Hey guys, welcome back to Yelena App. For today's video, we are going to show you how to design banners for your Shopify store using Canva. So if you're interested, let's start the tutorial. Now designing your banner for your Shopify store is actually pretty easy here. I'll be giving you some tips that you could basically implement to your designs for your Shopify store. Well, the first thing we need to do is we need to open up our store. In this case, go to shopify.com, log in into your account, and you want to view our store. Go to online store here, and you want to go to teams, and you want to click on customize. Now, to customize, what we need to do is we need to basically view the colors and the current design of our uh, current Shopify store. Now, in this case, uh, at the very top, you have the image banners section here, which in this case, you can basically upload your own if you want to. But I'll be showing you how to exactly do or edit your own via Canva. So let's go and open up Canva here, and we want to lock in. Now it's up, right? Let's go and click on create a design. And from here, we want to click on custom size. Now in this case, the width is going to be around 2000. The height is going to be around 600. Make sure to set this to pixel. Let's go and click on create new design. Now this should create a new design. As you can see, we have our banner here. Now, in this case, what we need to do is we now need to basically start designing a banner. Now we first need to uh, basically uh, think how it actually uh, works here. So the thing here with how a Shopify page or a Shopify banner here actually works, it actually adapts depending on what the actual site looks like. So for example, I'm going to exit this page here and I want to actually view my actual store here. So in this case, as you can see, it's going to be in a full width option here. So the wider the screen, the wider the banner is going to be. So we want to basically design this uh, from the center. So whatever image that you have here will be, uh, it will always be focused on the center. So in this case, if a screen is in this case, like for example, you will have a standard screen here, it's going to be around in this section only. But if you have a, or if the uh, visitor is using a uh, wider screen, uh, they will be using a wider format of that screen. But in turn, sometimes uh, a banner that is not properly sized can actually affect them, like for example, not looking good much, because in this case, they will be stretched or the actual look will be uh, broken. So what I would uh, recommend you try doing here is to design from the center then outwards so for example i'm going to add some elements here that i want to incorporate so let's just say i want to add a, a, a graphic here let's so click on see all here so just to give an example i'm going to add a bunch of graphics here for my design so that i'll be able to uh, design it so as you can see i'm start starting from uh, the center here and i want to go ahead and once i've actually uh, dot, uh, once I've actually added everything in here, I should be able to uh, design uh, whatever I want. So in this case, I'm going to design this as this one. So maybe I want to add another one for this one. I want to rotate it if as I could. And I also want to add one of the signs available here. So maybe I want to use this one and uh, Oops, so let's just return this uh, okay, and ro rotate it again. Now, in this case, let's go ahead and add one of the designs here. So, just want to position it in a way it's not that going to be heavy. So, make sure that we focus on the center here. So, I want to maybe add this one as a centerpiece, but you could basically add your own logo if you want to. So, maybe let's go and choose this one as a center. I could add whatever text here if you want to, but what I could do here, I could actually add a uh, other sections, like for example, this one, just to make it a trail on, along the sides. So maybe I could copy this, paste it again in here, paste on the other side as well. And uh, maybe I want to add this one as well and add it again in here. But yeah. So in this case, the main thing that you need to consider here is to make, uh, basically design from the center. But once you're done, you can go and click on share at the top right. I want to click on download. I want to save this as PNG. Let's go and click on download. But once it's actually downloaded, you can go ahead and go back into your Shopify store. 
let's go ahead and go and click on customize go to our uh, banner here let's go ahead and go to image banner and click on it but in this case let's go ahead and click on the select image button here and you want to add our image let's go ahead and choose our recently downloaded or uh, the uh, created banner or image but once it's actually uploaded you could go ahead and click on the done button at the bottom right here make sure it's selected but once it's actually uploaded you should now have your banner as you can see it is how it looks like like what i said before the main focus of the banner is going to be from the center so in this case uh once you actually go back into our store as you can see the actual banner here is pretty on the square side and it's actually quite um uh quite long or longer on the other or in the actual site or website here so whenever i actually reload it we should now have a different kind of look so it's going to actually adjust depending on the size of the screen but yeah so that's how you design your own banners for your shopify store and that's about it so hopefully this video was able to help you like and subscribe to your lineup thank you for watching